Okay, so this episode we're doing something a little different, and we're going to be reacting to a celebrity uh -huh. who recently did a controversial photo shoot for a magazine. Oh, oh no. Oh, it's not who I think it is. Well, hopefully I recognize the celebrity. The celebrity is Kim Kardashian. Oh, wow. Oh, my goodness. Why doesn't that surprise me? I don't know who it is. Do I recognize it? I don't know. She's not a celebrity. I refuse to give her that. Is she an actress? She isn't. Mm. Do you know anything about her? Way too much. She's an opportunity hog. She's famous for being famous. She did a, a sex tape. I know she was on this reality show, The Kardashians. They are incredible marketers of themselves. She's very well known for her tush. Well, she's a celebrity that a lot of people say has no actual talent or any reason to be famous, but is famous anyway. What do you think about that? I agree. That's exactly right. That's why I say she's not a celebrity in the true sense of the word. Doesn't make any sense to me. I like somebody who's famous for something. And her big claim to fame now seems to be that she, she had a baby and got married. And I go, well, that's not, that's not, I mean, lots of people can do that. She's captivating to a certain audience out there. Is that talent? Well, maybe in the strictest definition, it isn't, but there is a talent. So do you know anything about this photo shoot she recently did? No, I don't. Yeah, I heard about that. No. 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 Yes. I heard that she had some kind of picture that was uh, kind of revealing. Well, we're gonna show you some of the pictures. Lucky me. Probably good I'm sitting down. Am I gonna have to close my Christian eyes or what? Here is one version of the cover. <laughs> Wow. That's a pretty good shot. You could serve a drink on her butt. That's awesome. That looks so photoshopped. She's got very good uh, gear. I've heard rumors about those kind of butts, but I've never seen one. Well, she seems to be serving champagne. I think I'd prefer a different form of service. So there's also an alternate not safe for work cover. Here it is. She's got a big butt. Unbelievable. Holy cow. Oh my God. I like that one. <laughs> She's awfully Hippie. Oh my goodness, what a bum. Somebody had fun greasing her. No, I don't buy that. I think that's doctored. If I ever see her in person, I'll have to look closely. I'm really happy that she's proud of her body, and that's wonderful. I just go, when, where do we draw the line? You know, where do we draw the line? Is it is just anything okay? It might be an exploitation to some people, but I love this because I'm a man. So it didn't stop there. Here is another photo from the magazine. Wow, her whole body? We are in the, the era of the big butt. I wonder if she got implants in her ass because it just looks like it. It looks like it's uh, like a big plastic body with her head put onto it. I think it's cheap shot. It's like, hey, anything to get me on the cover of whatever. She does have a big patushka though, doesn't she? Do you want to see more? No. Nah, it's okay. You want to show me more? Confidentially, yeah. Do I want to see more? Not really. <laughs> You'll show me anyway, though. One more. <sighs> well, that's a little more than I had in mind. <laughs> I'm in love, and, and it's the real thing this time. Women can all feel insecure about how they don't look like this, and men can just decide that women should present at the drop of a dress. Am I attracted to it? Yeah. Should I be watching it? No, I don't think so. I'm a very happily married guy. What do you think about this photo shoot that Kim Kardashian did? Well, it disgusts me. She has a fabulous body and it's beauty. To me, it's, it's nothing much. It's just a girl without clothes. These images that you just showed, to me, are really pornographic. Hey, hey, everybody, look. I'll do anything as long as you spell my name right. If uh, some great actress did it, yes, I, I would say that it was a cheap thing to do. But what she is and what she does, this is just part of part of the whole thing. Why do you think she decided to do this? I don't know. You get naked, you get attention. She wants to get enough hits as even get more popular. For her, I don't even think it's the money. It's it's the fame. She needs more attention, more controversy. And she wants to show what a big butt she has. It's a question of, can you top this? Always trying to top herself or her competitors. The title on the bottom says, break the internet. What do you think they mean by that phrase? I don't know. She doesn't want the internet to be free? There would be so many viewers going on to see it that the internet would crash. It actually is an expression saying that once these get posted, everyone's gonna share them so much that the internet's gonna break. Oh, really? Do you think these pictures could do that? I certainly hope not. I kinda doubt it. Definitely, because she's a big name. I don't think it's gonna break the internet because nudity 
is uh, nothing really that new. So this is a controversial magazine spread that crossed into the mainstream with a lot of people talking about it. Do you remember any celebrity doing a photo shoot in the past that caused controversy? Marilyn Monroe? Well, I'm sure Marilyn Monroe did. Was it Demi Moore that did the cover of, I think, Vanity Fair, Fully Pregnant and Naked? Well, I think probably the best one was Burt. Burt Reynolds. Burt Reynolds did a centerfold for Cosmopo Cosmopolitan where he was naked. That really got a lot of people chattering. I can't imagine what that would have done on Twitter today. Another controversy about this is the photographer took the exact same champagne photo back in 1976 of a nude black woman in a photo book called Jungle Fever. <laughs> The title alone. That many at the time considered to be racist and exploitive. But now he's using a non-black woman to recreate the same image that was controversial in the 70s. What do you think about that? Well, I don't see why anybody would want to see two pictures so much alike. I think it's offensive no matter whose butt that is in doing that. I think that, I just think it's ridiculous. There obviously is a double standard, yeah. And there's still a lot of racism. I do recall reading an article that said, why is it that big butts have, were never appreciated until the white women started having them. And you kind of go, wait, what? There is a double standard. So when she was interviewed about the photo shoot, Kim said that she did it to feel more confident. What, she needed confidence? Come on. And then said, quote, as a role model, I'm not saying anyone else should do that, but for me it was an art project. Well, I think that, you know, we can just justify anything we do. And it taught me to do what you want to do. And before that, you didn't do what you wanted to do. Thoughts on her reasons? B. Yes. Well, I asked her publicist because he wrote the copy. It doesn't look like an art project to me. The real reason for doing it is to get the attention. That's fine. I mean, I think that's great, but I don't think the woman has any trouble feeling confident about herself. Confident in what? That, that she can exploit herself? She's not lifting up women as, 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 as anything other than sex objects. And they're much more than that. So finally, now you've seen the pictures, you've heard her reasons behind this. Do you think this is wrong for her to have done? I don't think it's wrong. I mean, if she wants to do it, she should. She can do anything she wants. Yeah, I think it was very well done. I see nothing wrong with it. Creatively, it was pretty damn good. I think she shouldn't have done it. She's a mom. She needs to grow up and act like a mom. It's her decision, but I think less of her now, and I think it's kind of despicable. I think so many people look up to her. I would ask her, I'd say, Kim, what are you doing to bring us all up and enlighten us and make us better human beings? Because you certainly could. Thanks for watching this episode of Elders React. Let us know in the comments what we should react to next. Also, subscribe to the React channel. New videos every week. Thanks again for watching, and we'll see you soon. Goodbye. <laughs>